something. Uh, this is my Kratky Hydroponics. Um, I brought these in maybe a week ago. Um, tomato, a tomato, sweet potato, and a zucchini. Now, when it came inside, there was another one here, which you can just see the stem. And this thing was bushy, but I found out that there were squash bugs in, in, the, in the plants. And it killed this one over here, so I cut that one off. And it looks like they have succeeded in killing this one. I thought I had gotten them all, but maybe I didn't. But I wanted to show you something. Uh, let's see, which one shall I use? Uh, let's use this one. Okay, because it's the closest and it's got the, right, it's got the right light. The other's in really bright light. Okay, so this is what a healthy root system looks like it, with the crack key. It has the air roots up above. It has the, and that little blue thing was off of the bucket, but it has the water roots down below, and the plant is healthy. It's got blossoms on it, yada, yada, yada. Okay, so this is the other one. And what happened, the zucchini drinks the water much, much more quickly than the tomatoes. So this one, the water had dropped probably down to about this level. And I tried to bring it up. And I brought it up slowly, but I think I killed the plant. This is what its roots look like. You can see the division where there are no roots or very few. And then the roots down below are rotting. And that um, gap where all of the roots have broken off, um, the roots drowned. So um, one of the problems was the squash bugs, but also the roots drowned. And I am expecting this to keel over within the next day or two because the roots are completely rotted and those will not come back. But I wanted to show you that. Um, Kratky Hydroponics is a system that is designed actually for short season stuff like lettuces um, but I decided to use it for longer season so I use it for a bunch of different things I'm still working out the details if you're interested in the Kratky hydroponics information that uh, on the project that I've been doing um, there are other videos available but um, we have a healthy plant that the water level was not not that low. We have a dying plant where the water level dropped. Uh, one of the things with crap key is that the water level needs to remain relatively stable because once a root has become an air root, it can drown. When the, um, when the roots are okay, can't even see it because the light's too bright. Sorry. Um, when the roots have turned themselves into air roots so that they're absorbing air, um, if they sit in water, they will um, die. So that's, that's what happened with the zucchini. Um, so with Kratky, the uh, water level is very, very important. And I haven't figured out a way, I mean, I know there are lots of ways, but I haven't really figured out a way to make that happen. But, so I just have to check so I put this, I have a little a line right there, and a line right there, and put it in the water, and it should be relatively close to that first line. That's how I measure the water levels. Okay, so that's what I wanted to show you was the root mass after it has drowned. I will talk with you later.